This video is sponsored by Squarespace, an all-in-one platform to construct the ultimate virtual appeal to aid in your business. Good morning, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today is Monday, May 16th, I believe. It's Monday, May 16th, 10.01. And I just came back home. I had to take my British literature final today. Senior year is officially ending. And I'm about to graduate. Oh, do you guys want to see my cap and gown? Let me show you. Because I, I don't know if it's too big or like what. All I know is I got my cap and gown ready. I'm kind of in a run. I just planned on coming back home, changing some clothes, and then heading back out again. Literally, ever since I got my car, I have not been home for more than 12 hours. I told my family, prepare to be sick of me because I'm not going to be home. I wanted to just take you guys along with me on my my week and vlog it because I think this week no I'm not just gonna be sitting in my room doing work oh I do have an exam to study for because I have to go take another exam tomorrow but I think I did really good on this exam hopefully because British literature that's like it just comes natural I could not study anything for British lit or just literature in general and I would pass the class with an A every time and I got to exempt two exams because I had a 90 or above in both of the classes and I'm praying that I get a 90 in this literature class a 90 or above in this literature class I think I did pretty good on that final I was <laughs> Zooming past the question. I'm about to get ready to go to the gym. I have a lot to kind of catch you guys up on. I haven't really like been documenting everything. I recently just joined, well not joined, but I'm trying out this gym. I'm 99% sure I'm going to be attending this gym. I've been like gym searching around my local area to see what gyms will cater to my needs, what gyms, you know, be doing a little bit too much, and what gyms are perfectly right. And this gym, I think I like it. The only problem, the only problem is that it's in like a more bougie part of town. So, you know, there's a lot of folks <laughs> now every so now and then i'll see my kin folk walk into the gym today is monday so it's leg day for me um, i'm just gonna take you guys along with my workout hopefully they let me record i don't know if they will or i don't even know if i may record it honestly i don't know because i'll be looking real focused during my workout and today i really want to go hard because it's the start of the week and this will set the tone for the week i encourage you guys to move your body get active take care of yourself let me go change into my clothes and get everything ready and let's head out Y'all, look at this. Oh my gosh, I'm going to cry. Venice, I cannot believe I just did that. Jesus. Thank the Lord I got these when I went car shopping. I'm gonna go get my car clean. I literally was just about to go to the car wash. Okay, y'all, let's clock in for the gym. I just came out the gym. It may not look like it because I've been sitting in my car for like 20 minutes so far. Went in there to do a little quick rinse on my face just to make sure girls not getting breakouts, especially with working out the mat. But my thoughts on this new gym, I just would like to share them because, you know, y'all are going to be coming along with me like to gym hunt. Personally, I feel like, so let's just list off the pros and cons about this gym. The pros. It has really nice equipment. It's very clean. I like the layout. Like some gyms, I don't like the layout because it doesn't allow you to like work out in private. There's a lot of like different and ducked off areas that you could work out if you're not comfortable working out in front of everybody. They have a sauna. Well, they're getting one very soon. Um, I like the area around here. Now, the con. It's not open 24 hours. It closes pretty early, but they also open really early, so I feel like that kind of compensates for the lack of hours. I can't think of any other cons with the gym itself other than the people. Personally, I just feel like this gym holds a lot of like racial tension energy. That's kind of like the vibe I'm getting from it. It's just you feel the energy. Like I pick up on energy so quickly. I don't know if it's because I'm new or like you haven't seen me before, but there's not many black people in there. There's not many colored people in there. It's predominantly white. They all look like they know each other or if they don't know each other, it just looks like they're willing to know each other like but just like in their community it's very like close-knit you could tell it's like picture a lot of jocks <laughs> i don't know i just don't feel as welcome as i felt in other gyms before or i just don't really see much diversity but anyway i peeped when i was coming to my car that i had pollen particles on my car so we're gonna be going to the car wash
so later that day when i was at the mall i decided to stop by this dog center this is like really random footage but yeah so um enjoy this footage if you really care to see it oh my god I'm at the mall right now. Sister told me about this dog play that we really wanted to see there. And I'm already upset. This convinced me out of not getting it because I was going to buy the dog. Say, come. Oh my gosh, he is so hyper. <laughs> <laughs> He's teething. That's why they gave him a toy. I let him bite on my shoe. He is so cute. He's literally the size of my hand. He's two pounds. Excuse me, sir. No, the dog is $5,000. I was this close putting payment options now but then we just bought a car he's so freaking cute now okay look look at this look out no. What's up, y'all? We are finally wrapping up my online website given to us by Squarespace.com. I have majority of my website already complete. But I just wanted to show you guys a few finishing touches. Here you see majority of my website, my header, my slogan, my description, and my embedded links. We're gonna go ahead and add one more section for integrated video links that you can find on my YouTube channel. This section is strictly for productivity as well as providing a description for newcomers. One feature I came across while discovering the website was it allows you to see the mobile view. So if you wanted to see this on your phone this is how it would look secondly i did not know that you could share the link but of course that would make most sense squarespace offers a short link that you can copy and paste into your web browser and it will directly bring you to your website be sure to start your all-in-one website at www.squarespace.com for a free trial when you're sold make sure you use my link to save 10 percent off your first purchase of any website using my code venice Soleil. and thank you squarespace for sponsoring this portion of today's video so the day after i went to the mall and not film the entire day so it kind of just jumped into a hole two days later but i was gonna actually trash this footage of me getting my nose pierced i don't know if you guys peed but i got my nose pierced <laughs> and i ended up recording it so here is that footage now so sorry if this video is like all over the place literally very sporadic not even in order y'all i just <laughs> bear with me okay <laughs> workers too from the latest laps and oh my mama's gonna kill me <laughs> Hello, welcome back. Um, I just wanted to get my nose done. Okay, just a nose piercing. Fill this out for me, dear. Thank you. Three. What is the date? It's May fifth, thirteenth. Okay. Oh my gosh, did y'all just see that? When was the last time that I ate? That was like four in the morning. Twelve. Oh, I just ate. Oh, I just ate. I don't know why I do this to myself. <gasps> Who gave me a car? Nobody told me to get a car because this is what I be doing now. Yeah. Oh, which side do you want to do? I did not think about that. Which side do you sleep on? Sleep on both sides. Which side is your selfie side? My selfie side? This side, but I want to do it on this side. I don't know. It's a hard decision. I actually pierced my nose on myself, but I ended up taking it out. That's fine. That's my Yeah, that's not bad at all. We're just working. You're tough, I'll tell you that. You're tough. Oh, I think you wiped the dot a little bit. Oh, I'm sorry. We're going to go about right there, which is it? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Oh, and you know what's funny? We talked about it. That's the worst part, okay? Oh my gosh, wait. <laughs> this is about to be built. Right outside my neighborhood. Now it's What causes the bleeding? Uh, oh, it just depends. It could have been scar tissue because of where you had it already. Um, some people just use yeah, it more than others. Sheesh. You are a little bit of bleeder. Do mm -hmm. you remember it last time? <laughs> Literally right, right at the end of the day, but I forgot how much you're 
it's shiny and pretty, but try not to touch it while it's healing unless you're cleaning it. Okay. Um. <laughs> my mom is gonna kill me. But guess what? Guess what? We got it for ourselves. This is what it's looking like, if you guys can see. Um, it actually, the pain wasn't bad. I think, honestly, I think what made it work was that I pierced this side of my nose. Looked out at my channel. I pierced it by myself. I was like 14, 15. So I think it hurt because it was a scar tissue. Same exact place, but I got it back. I'm 18 now, so you feel me? I can do what I need to do in my business, okay? What's up, you guys? Today it is today. It's Wednesday, May 18th, currently 5:13 p.m. Right now, I'm in Atlanta. This is my first time driving downtown with my new car. Don't play with your girl. Why isn't it focusing? Oh, uh, right now, I'm currently waiting on my sister to come meet me here. She had an appointment to go to, so we drove separate ways. This is her calling right now. Hello? Are you here? No, I can come right now. Girl, where are you at? I'm literally a minute from the rest. Wait, where are you parked? Can you send me your current location? Yeah. Never mind. But yeah, so let me go meet her first. Or cute restaurant. I know that they have vegan options. We wanted, she planned us to go. Last week, she told me that she wanted to go. So here we are. Today, I didn't get to get a workout in. I'm so sad, but it's okay. okay so I'm going to go head over to the restaurant now, and I'm going to talk to you guys later. Okay, 
Okay, hey y'all. I just made it back home. Made it back in town. Y'all, I literally heard 12 coming down the street, like zooming past me. I was this close to following because they were heading towards my house. I had a really good night. We forgot to vlog majority of it, but literally all day today and yesterday was me just running around shopping. I have a new obsession with going to the mall. I've been to every mall in my county thus far. This morning, I literally, like, I couldn't even have recorded if I wanted to. I want to go take my last final today. One that I was really, like, stressing about was my economics one. Even though economics, economics is literally so easy, but um, I did not study one. I, I'm gonna be completely honest. I did not study one time for that exam. I vividly remember last night I was going to study because I had just came from the mall. I had worked out. Like I pretty much felt so accomplished, and I was just gonna. The last I needed to do was to study. I don't know what possessed me to take melatonin right before I started studying, but I figured like, okay, an hour of studying, melatonin's probably gonna kick in like 30, 40 minutes. That junk knocked me out clean. I don't know if it was because I was already tired, but I was not. Out. I literally like physically could not keep my eyes open to save my life. So I went to sleep. <laughs> one thing I ain't gonna lose no sleep. I'm not gonna stress myself out. That's one thing. I am going to stay youthful because I'm not stressing about anything. Y'all not about to freaking age me 10 years forward over some schoolwork. Sorry, but you know, luckily God was on my side. You feel me? Your girl just be finessing her way. I swear, like even my family says it, I just be finessing my way through high school. But yeah, I woke up this morning and I really, really wanted to go to the gym, but I couldn't. They did not have time. They tell us to go to the school by 7 o'clock. The exam starts at 7 30. But the day that I started testing, I was there at 7 o'clock and they made me wait outside the door till 7 30. And I'm not, I was not gonna do that again. On the second and third day, I didn't come in at 7 o'clock. I came at 7 30. Because that's when y'all want to start testing, right? Now, why when I come in at 7 30, y'all are got your freaking pencils and notebook paper out ready to start testing. And I'm sitting here looking goofy. But yeah, I just wanted to update you guys. Perhaps I will go to the gym tomorrow and record if I can wake up early. If not, don't kill me. But I do really want to go to the gym and like actually record. I don't know.
I worked out, I hit lower body today. I really was in and out. I didn't even like go to the sun. I'm just like mad that I didn't wake up on time. I usually wake up at 4 30. I'm usually up by 4 30, out the door by 5, arrived at 5 30. I got an errand to do today, so that's part of the reason why I wanted to wake up at a timely manner. <laughs> What's up y'all? Just came back from the gym. I met with my friend yesterday at like 5 o'clock and we both got a really good workout in. And then we were supposed to meet again today. And I was too jugged off of melatonin and I set my alarm clock a whole hour later than I was supposed to get up. I threw off my whole morning. It's okay. I mean, it's really cloudy today. Like, there's just a lot going on. You know, we're just kind of pushing through it. I've literally been eating this for breakfast for like the past month now. It's a protein waffle with sausage. Beyond meat sausage. So it's vegan. And then vegan egg. Um, I don't know how much protein it has, but I know every one of them has a good number of questions. I'm planning this week. I have graduation in literally two days. Tomorrow I actually have to go to my school to go practice for the graduation. We have like graduation rehearsals and then I have graduation the next day after that. I'm literally not prepared. So that's one thing that I need to work on is like my management. But it's okay. I still have two days. So hopefully today I can go get my nails done. I actually have a few things that I wanted to get done today. I know I need to fill my tank and then I want to get my nails and my toes done. And then I gotta go to the mall to look for an outfit. Y'all I just been this 10 30 now i should be leaving the house within the next 15. my nails shouldn't take longer than an hour because i'm getting a filling and i'm just getting my toes in try to go to the mall make it to the mall by noon and find something really quick and cute because i really am just over it like i just want my diploma just give me the diploma but y'all i literally threw out like all gave away all my clothes i want to say like last fall and i gave it all away to donation the ones that i did keep were just pieces that i felt like would be a good use i just clear out my whole wardrobe because before the pandemic i was like freshman year to senior year i have a big difference in like just styles in general like that are appealing to me and that closet was not it so i threw literally all my clothes out either out if it was damaged or i gave it away if it was still it could be like used by somebody else as of recently like on my free time now that i got my car i've been going to the mall so often. it's kind of nice to see like what my style is now that i'm a senior or just even like getting older but if i'm not at the gym in like tight clothes i'm always wearing like sweat but i'm gonna finish my breakfast Kinda on a time crunch because I need to get home and edit. And I'm waiting on this video to get approved so I can drop my video. Yeah, I'm about to just go get my meals done, finish my breakfast, and I'll see you when I see you. Y'all, I just realized my mic wasn't on this whole time. I don't know if this camera's audio good or if you even picked up any audio, but who was gonna tell me? Anyways, I'm about to get gas. Y'all, I've been shopping for literally three hours now. I've been to two different malls, we really like 20 different stores, and I still haven't found a dress. Graduation is in 24 hours. <laughs> Y'all, we got a winner. They originally said it was an eight, but then the dress size is like a four. No, I think it's actually like a two. 
it's a it's a whole size too y'all know this body is not no two but i'm gonna try to get in a bigger size so that i'm not like super uncomfortable but the only other thing that i need to get is some heels and i have to get black heels because if not i can't walk the stage but there's nobody around me guys so that's why i have my mask on but hopefully Okay, what's up you guys? So, I just got home. Well, I got home like an hour ago. It's 9.20 now. I got my nails done. My toes done. Um, I was just talking with my mom and my sister. I literally haven't like actually sat down and spoke with my family in a minute. I've just been out all the time just doing stuff. But, y'all, you know, I'm more now. I'm getting ready to like take a shower, take my makeup off. I feel really greasy and dirty. So, I'm going to take a shower, get ready for bed. Because I have to go to the gym early tomorrow. And I have graduation rehearsals. So, yeah. But, I did get my dress. When I first went to the mall, I wanted to get something from Macy's. I don't know why it took me so long, but I finally found every dress that I like. And I didn't care what size it was. I was going to see if I fit whether it was freaking big enough or some too small. I thought my dress size was like an 8. Y'all, this dress size is a 2. I don't know how I fit it, but it's pretty stretchy. I think that's also why. But I, as soon as I put it on, I like this. I'm so like, it's, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it looks really, really cute when I have it on. Shows low hips and whatnot. But yeah, so this with my cap and gown. I I think it's gonna look really nice and i just have i don't know if i showed you guys my toes these are my toes look like and then my hands so everything is like literally pure white color i literally didn't know what i was gonna wear to graduation up until two hours ago and i have graduation in 24 hours i got it from get they had no other sizes y'all but it was either i got the dress that i like or i left with no dress and i wasn't gonna leave them all with nothing in my hand i really wanted to do white i feel like that's more like a color for like a new chapter like coming of age i'm about to be a big girl y'all i can't believe this oh my god anyways i don't know when i'm gonna continue the vlog so I'm gonna talk to you guys later. I'm really tired. So the next two days I had graduation rehearsal and then the day after that I had graduation. There was just too much going on. I recorded at my graduation rehearsal but I didn't feel like it needed to be inserted just because you probably could find out exactly where I live. Next day I got a little bit of footage. Barely any because I literally was almost late to graduation but my sister got some footage from the actual ceremony so I'll just insert those. But yeah um don't kill me because graduation itself was just stressful. Mm -hmm. 